Iran sought pressure Israel and revenge airstrikes on Gaza, claiming on Monday it would be willing release 199 hostages known have been taken during of more than 1,400 people by Hamas terrorists long supported by Tehran. He stated terrorist group stated they are ready to take necessary measures for release citizens and civilians held by resistant groups. But these measures require preparations or impossible under daily armament of various parts Gaza by Zionists. However, Hamas has not yet made such a proposal public. But the terror group argued on Monday that the unprecedented attack on October 7 was a lone effort not directed by Iran. Despite widespread belief among Israeli and Western officials, Iranian Foreign Ministry spokesman Nasser Kanani said that Hamas is considering releasing 199 hostages if Israel stops airstrikes. According to Hamas, war in Gaza is a war. And the decision to enter it was a Palestinian decision taken by Hamas and its military wing. Is at in Al Qassam brigades. In conjunction with resistance groups. Lebanon representative Ahmed Abdul Hadi. Abdul Hadi said Hamas ally Iran and Hezbollah would not allow Israel to overwhelm Gaza or launch a comprehensive ground offensive, but that the groups deliberately left uncertainty about when and how they would respond. This depends on developments in the situation at the time. He said that surprises will be announced if there is a ground attack. Regardless of the level in Gaza or if more and more s continue to be committed in Gaza and Hamas exhausts its resources. Israel stood firm on Monday, with Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's office saying there is no ceasefire. This comes after the Israel Defense Forces confirmed on Monday that at least 199 hostages were known to be held in Gaza. This number is much higher than previously believed. Military spokesman Rear Admiral Daniel Haggery said the families had been informed. He did not say how many of those held captive were foreigners or who was holding them. But most are believed to be in the hands of Hamas, which rules Gaza. Terrorists had previously threatened to release s of the executed hostages in revenge for Israeli counterattacks. Five Israel announced that it would soon launch a ground attack on Gaza. AFP via the Iranian government supports Hamas. And according to reports, Iranian security officials are thought to have helped the terrorist organization plan its secret attack on Israel on October 7. Iran has warned that it too could go to war if Israel launches a widely anticipated ground attack on the Gaza Strip in the coming days. The Israeli military said again on Saturday that it was preparing to implement a wide range of offensive operation plans, which include, among other things, an integrated and coordinated attack from air, sea and land. Five photos people reported to have been kidnapped or killed by Hamas were hung on the fence of the Israeli embassy during a rally in support Israel in Dublin, Ayer.